It's a rainy day. That's Ohio weather for you. Uh, heading to do another food review. A place called Soho or some some mumbo jumbo. I don't know if that's the way you pronounce it or not. I'm uh, going to do a food review on that place. Heard great things about it from a lot of different people. Thought I'd give it a try. And um, we're not going to do this review alone. We're going to go with uh, two of my buddies. So let's uh, meet those guys first. David's putting on as much yum yum sauce as possible. Always the yum yum sauce. It's really good. David believes in All right, we are uh, we are live here. We'll edit that part out of the video. Yes, he will. Um, he's going to try his first official bite. Okay, it's like uh, look at where the stain is on the pork. His mouth was that part on that pork. What would you? Um, what would you rate this out of uh, out of five? Rice is okay. It's, I've had better. Um, no. Shrimp's okay. The quality of the food is better. But the flavors are better at Benny Hunter. Steak's good. Um, I give it three and a half nunchucks out of five. There you have it. It's so dark in here. Oh All right, what did you get? I'm oh, sorry, that spotlight is a little distracting. Um, so for my appetizer, I have uh, shrimp tempura sushi. Uh, already ate that. Was it worth how much that expensive cost was? Uh, it was nine dollars. Uh, it was recommended by Joe over here. Um, Taste was pretty good. Uh, they, they didn't bring any wasabi or soy sauce out. I thought that was kind of odd. Um, and they also had strawberries as like a side thing, which I thought was very weird. Uh, but overall, taste-wise, give it a three and a half. Now I'm out of five. Okay, okay. Um, as far as the chicken and shrimp, 
Um, I, I would agree with his statement about overall. Benihana's is probably better, but I did enjoy some of the taste flavors of this. Um, the shrimp tasted very nice as well as the chicken. Uh, it was good. Um, I think I'd give it the same rating. Three and a half out of five. Okay, okay. And finally, all right. What do you think about yours, sir? So, eat a lot of hibachi. I like hibachi, so this doesn't make me dislike hibachi. But I'll say, thank you. A couple spots in, in Cincinnati that are known for their hibachi. That's um, Benny Hobbs being number one. Uh, Soho, which is this place, and then um, we have Iron Chef in Fields Urban. I would say Iron Chef's probably at the, at the bottom of the three. Benny Hahn is number one, and this will be number two. I will say, the quality of the cook is better here. The chicken's still moist, where sometimes at Benny Hahn it can be dried out. The shrimp isn't overcooked. Has a nice glaze on it, nice sear on it, good flavor. But overall, it's lacking in, 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 in the punch that you get from Benihana. And I think that's because Benihana uses a lot more garlic butter and they soy their food a lot more than they do here. So overall, I'm gonna say this is my number two spot when it comes to hibachi in Cincinnati. Benihana number one. Iron Chef, don't go. All right, final review. It was okay, but nothing to write home about at all. Uh, first thing, um, these kind of establishments, if the cook is like getting into it, you know, tooting and making sounds and flipping the knives and all that, makes the atmosphere a lot better ours was not doing any of that was it it was just like he wasn't even really happy to be there <clears throat> now we turned around when our cook left and the cook on the other table man everybody was having a ball he's like flipping around the knives talking to the people you know joking around our guy he it was like he didn't even want to be there and then we looked around and there was probably two other cooks same way they were just like blah which i mean if it, it might might just be me but when you go to a hibachi place i mean that's kind of like what you're expected is to see these people like you know talk to you and flip around the knives and all that i guess i'm just old school uh rice was not was not up to par like my friend said the benihana's place 10 times better i have to agree Shrimp was okay, not that good. Um, the steak was decent. I liked the steak. Um, the soup was good, but it's the same everywhere you go. Same with the salad. It's all the same in any of these places. So, I mean, those were good. They tasted like everybody else's. Um, the sweet tea, no. Not, not good at all either. So, I mean... <sighs> For the price that I paid for the meal, uh, unfortunately, I'm going to have to say was not worth it. Now, we might just had a bad night. Again, I probably would have scored it a little bit better if if the cook, the cook made it go down a little bit. Because he wasn't just as happy or... You know what I mean? So, unfortunately, that's going to help the rating a little bit with the going down. So... I mean, if you, it's okay to come here, but I don't think it's worth the money. I would probably go to like a Benihana, but that's just my opinion. And if you want more opinions, make sure to hit subscribe and watch all the other great videos. And there'll be more coming up.